Welcome back to Garfield Academy. All right, for our video today, I thought we might do a kind of a short lesson from history, and uh, so we'll just jump right into it. Uh, this gentleman right here that you see is uh, Mr. Joshua Slocum. Uh, Joshua Slocum, he lived from 1844 to 1909. He was the first person to circumnavigate the earth alone. Um, he wrote the book, Sailing Alone Around the World. Um, he is uh, pretty famous for this. He launched uh, his boat, the Spray. I'm going to show a picture of the Spray here. This is a, a painting of him building the Spray. He uh, sailed from April 24th, 1895. He launched from uh, Boston, Massachusetts. Sailed around the world, returning June 27th. 1898 to Newport, Rhode Island, so just a little bit over three years, um, and he described his journey uh, in, a, in his book that he wrote again, Sailing Alone Around the World. And in this time of social distancing and, and isolation, kind of that book title jumped out at me. I had read uh, snippets of this years ago, and uh, this just kind of happened to come back to me um, recently. So something he said uh, kind of stood out going to put it right here. Sorry, we're super old school today. If you can't see it, there's actually a little seashell, just thinking about sailing around the sea. Uh, I thought we put the seashell up today. All right, so this is the quote that uh, kind of stood out to me um, that I thought I would talk about for just a little bit. But um, in his period of sailing around the world, just over three years, he spent a great deal of time alone. And this is what he has to say about being alone. He says, I'd already found it was not good to be alone, and so I made companionship with what there was around me, sometimes with the universe, and sometimes with my own insignificant self. But my books were always my friends, let fail all else. So, um, even for a guy who spends a great deal of time alone, just in the course of his journey, uh, he recognized it wasn't good to be alone, and so he did what he could when he was alone sailing around the world uh, to make companionship with what was around him. Um, and I think in the next couple of videos, we'll talk about this, things you can do, just being observant of the outside world. And then um, I'll talk about some free resources for reading. If you're interested in reading, uh, you might notice we have uh, copies of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory downstairs available for anybody who wants it. Uh, we'll put out a couple of chapters each week. Um, and so, yeah, that's just... Kind of a brief lesson from history from this gentleman, Joshua Slocum, if you'd never heard of him. Uh, I'm sure some folks have, some folks haven't. Um, but that's it, a real short lesson from history. Um, when you're alone, do what you can to make companions with what there is around you. And so we'll talk about just kind of observing the outside world and then a video or two coming up. And then uh, I'll probably put a video out about uh, some reading resources that are available to you. So I hope this finds you well. You're having a good day or night, whenever you happen to watch this. And we'll uh, be seeing you soon. Take care.